Chapel, an earthquake and a huge aftershock have rocked Northern California in the last 24 hours. The first was breaking news yesterday here on ABC 10 News at 5. A 5.5 quake shook an area near Amanor, Plumas County. And the second, a 5.2 aftershock happened while most of us were sleeping at around 3 this morning. And the shaking may not be over yet. I spoke with the USGS scientists and they're tracking the chances of yet another earthquake to hit within the next week. Scary moments for the Plumas Pines Resort on Thursday afternoon when a 5.5 magnitude earthquake rocked their business, the epicenter less than 10 miles from the popular Lake Almanor in Plumas County and was felt widely here in the Sacramento area and as far away as San Francisco. According to the USGS, when an earthquake hits, there's a chance another will follow. 6% chance of a magnitude 5 aftershock within a week of the event from yesterday at 419. Exactly 11 hours later, it came true, a 5.2 aftershock waking some people from their sleep. Robert DeGroote with the USGS says it's possible for another quake to hit within the week. You know that the earthquakes were were both very, were inside of the, inside of Lake Almanor, uh, but in, as far as a, a named fault or a, a particular cause, that's still under, under examination. At the USGS, DeRoot focuses on alerting residents with the Shake Alert, an earthquake early warning system for the West Coast available through an app. More than 100,000 people received an alert Thursday. Alerts are sent based on location and the impact you feel. Alerts are prioritized for people who could feel potentially something like on the order of a heavy truck passing your house where the building would shake a little bit up to where items might be falling off of shelves and, and breaking. USGS says California has 50 earthquakes a day. So think about all those ones that you don't feel. And we checked in with the city of Susanville at the epicenter. And the fire chief says there are no known damages at this time.